Ah, uh, summer's here, school's out. But what to do with the kids? Well, if you aren't going away on holiday anywhere, then I've got some fun things for the month of July that you and the kids can enjoy. But first off, there are three things going on all summer that you can take part in. Number one, have you ever noticed that around Monaco there are a lot of fireworks, but you never know when or why? Oh look, fireworks, ha, huh. must be Tuesday. But what I do know is that every summer in the port, there's the fireworks competition, and I've got the schedule. Grab your chairs, your blankets, and your kids and head on down to the port. July 3rd at Switzerland, July 18th, Belgium, August 1st, Italy, and August 8th, Slovakia. Number two, free concerts. Through August 28th, every Tuesday at 7 o'clock, there'll be a concert here in the Marche de la Condamine. And every Monday and Wednesday at 7.30 here in Square Gusto in the Condamine next to the police station. And for number three, the fun fair. The horses are heading out and the fair is coming in. From July 4th through August 23rd, you and the kids can head on down here to the port and burn off some of that energy doing fun fair activities. What else do we have? Well, remember, July 1st through 15th at the Monte Carlo Country Club, it's the kids tennis tournament. You can grab a seat and watch for free. And then from July 2nd through 5th, you've got the Monte Carlo Polo Cup. Starting on July 3rd, Friday at 12 noon, the riders and horses will do a parade through Casino Square. And then they're up to Stad Devins in La Turbie for the first matches at 4.30 on Friday. Then on Saturday, the matches are from 5.30 p.m. to 7 p.m. And then on Sunday at 4 o'clock, the semifinals start. And at 5.15, there's the ladies hat contest. And at 6 p.m., the finals match. You can get tickets at MonteCarloPoloClub.mc or you can sit around the pitch on the outskirts for free. And for the weekend of July 9th through 11th, the bay will be busy with racing boats for the second Solar One Monte Carlo Cup. And in my opinion, the best vantage point is this pier and the one on the other side. <laughs> or maybe you and the kids want to peruse some contemporary art. Well, Art Monaco 2015 will be here at the Chapiteau and Fonvier the weekend of July 9th through 12th. The tents will be full of art from drawings to paintings to photography, calligraphy, multimedia, you name it, it'll be in there. On July 10th here at the Stad, there's a friendly match between Monaco and Dynamo Moscow. And then back here on the 17th, you certainly don't want to miss the international athletics competition, Hercules. For another art option, you and the kids can take in the Chagall to Malavik exposition at the Grimaldi Forum going from July 12th through September 6th. You can get tickets at GrimaldiForum.com. Should be a super exhibition. And all through July, Beef at Monaco will be doing summer camps for the kids. You can pick one week or all three weeks. They'll be having lots of fun with water games, running games, circuits, challenges, learning to be part of a team, learning new knowledge on healthy eating, and even getting some fun healthy recipes to cook with mom and dad. To sign up or for more information, contact Beef at Monaco. Then, up here on the rock on July 24th, it'll be fun for the whole family. There'll be parades and entertainment at the Skiratu Festival. From 6 to 8 p.m., the streets will come alive with this year's Western theme. There will be bands to entertain you, beautiful costume dancers, crazy animators of all kinds, parades of floats, and of funny characters. And after 8, there will be a DJ party in the Place de la Marie. And lastly, from July 31st to August 23rd, you can take in the circus dinner show at the Chapiteau. Get your tickets early. Well, there certainly are a lot of things going on in July, so you've got lots of choices. But if all else fails, you've always got the pool. Have a great time, and I'll see you next episode. Bye!